Bonjour, one more day here in France. We're gonna do a little walk out to the vineyards from our apartment behind me there. We're in Bone, and we're gonna walk out to the west of town and up to the vineyards. I think it's the uh, Grands Cruise route. We're gonna kind of go up the hill. We'll just see what we're gonna do. We got a bottle of wine with us, and maybe just chill up there and enjoy the view and have some wine. So come along with us. After winding our way through the city of Bone, we made it out to the Velo route that we had come from or so a few days earlier back into Bone on. We'd be on this for just a little bit and then we would head up to the hills straight ahead there. Just noticing how rocky the soil is here. Not quite like Avion where it was just rocks and you couldn't even see any dirt. but early rocky. They tell us that's what makes the wine so good. Now we decided to deviate we're supposed to go a little bit to the right and then back to the left and we notice this goes right through and it's nice it's dirt with a little bit of grass you just can't beat this isn't this beautiful wow Well, we missed our turn off. It's right here. It's a little dirt road. I was looking for a paved road and there was another paved road there, but this is what we want. So we're, we're kind of cutting the route a short a little bit. And we'll go down along here. Yep, beautiful though, huh? Well, this is a route I found on the uh, Bone uh, tourism site, bone.org or com or .fr, probably .fr. They have a bunch of different routes, and the good thing about them, compared to most of them, you can download the GPX uh, files for them, and it really helps. So this kind of looks like the uh, the Trulies that we saw down in Puglia a bit. 
But uh, looks like there might be a door. Domain, yeah, it's a domain. So it just looks like a place you can sit. But, yeah. No, it's just a little, and there's a bottle of wine, empty bottle of wine in there. Well, we're down off the hill here, almost the town of Bone. We're gonna take a left here and walk through some of the vineyards and not go on the bike trail that we were on before. It's a nice little uh, hike if you're in the town. Just walk out, go through the vineyards, be up there, maybe have a bottle of wine, a little take a mini with you and enjoy it. It's probably gonna be close to five for us, even though we cut it a little short. If you took the whole route as it's on the tourism thing from downtown, probably about six or so miles. It's just a beautiful, beautiful hike. This gorgeous, look at that, isn't that amazing? Wow. Well, thanks for joining us on this hike. I'll probably take a little bit of video on our way back in the town. But uh, just appreciate you joining us on these French adventures of ours. We'll be back in the United States and doing some more adventures. So then, au revoir. So we found out these little doors you see all along here are personal wine cellars. And I guess there's probably millions of bottles of wine stored around the city in those little cellars. We actually saw a lady come out of one of the ones here with a bottle of wine one evening. And here's the uh, bakery where I had my morning uh, problems. I have to go get my chocolate croissant every morning. and. Actually, this little restaurant, we went there last night and it was really good food. As I mentioned, we had a great meal at that restaurant and some wine there. We really enjoyed the food in the Bone area. It was just amazing. Being able to go out and walk in the vineyards and just wander around and enjoy the beauty of the area. So if you're in the Burgundy area, we highly recommend that you spend time in Bone and just enjoy this great city and the surroundings of the vineyards. Thank you for watching our video. Like it if you liked it. Please comment below and subscribe so you can stay current with our adventures.